kid and you're asking like, what do we do about? Is you sign a contract with someone? So real quick, before you did that, did you? More than 30 years. I got my real estate license in the um, And your your origin story. Is that he uh, he made an age joke the last time we were. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna use that kooka. You know, I'm a little more strict with what I'm I'm looking at. Uh, you know, I sent him a lead, and honestly, I I I don't expect anything back. But if I get something, yeah, I got you. Bro. It happens. Yeah, you, this, you know, and the guy was pretty nice actually. I talked yeah. to him personally. And he was like, yeah, you know, come out and we set a time. But then that day he was like, hey, and he reached out. And so that tells yeah. me that he's interested in getting yes. in this. So uh, I'll definitely convert. But once it sells, I got you, bro. Most definitely. So that's another way you, you know, you as a wholesaler can work on this. Now, as a wholesaler, if you're in there and you're doing it for a few years and you're getting the hang of it and you're doing this and you want to become an agent, become an agent, um, you know, under a broker that allows you to wholesale. Yes. Okay. That's, That's the key good. thing. Okay. Mm -hmm. Cause not all agents will allow you to wholesale. Um, I plan on doing it someday, but I have my day job. I have a lot of I'm counting days. I'm on. holding my breath. <laughs> 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 I there's there, I got a lot going on, so you know. Yeah, what the real estate retail space needs is with diversity, right? Everyone doing yes. the same over and over again, right? But we need wholesalers to become agents. Bring that yes. aspect of the business. There are people thirsty in the retail space for the wholesale knowledge. So you get licensed, you will have like a ready-made uh, community that wants to hear from you like hey yeah. like you're our master tell us master what to do <laughs> <laughs> exactly so and and that's the thing you know it's i you know you take that knowledge you just move it forward and remember what i said in the beginning is you move and you strive to be one percent better every single day okay i'm if you some days you might move one percent better and move two percent back who knows yeah. but as long as the next day you move one percent better that yeah. it's all forgiven right you know that you just got to keep moving forward yeah. so um you know one other thing that there this is uh we're gonna we're gonna end the show here but one thing that i do want to ask everybody out there for is it's a personal thing and i i'm i am and I don't usually bring that stuff up. All I'm asking for is prayers at the moment for my mother. I, she has, she's fighting pancreatic cancer at the moment. So um, we know that there's no getting rid of it. Yeah. It's just, we're trying to prolong her life as much as possible. Yeah. Uh, so I at least want to say, uh, you know, just prayers. I, on my, on my, uh facebook page i do have a there's a link on there uh it's pinned at the top for a gofundme if anybody wants to put anything it's just to help her out with bills until some uh disability comes in for her i uh, you know but at the same point you know i'm mainly just asking for prayers that's it you know that's all i'm asking for right now everything everything that happens to us it's by god for us yes right so we ask god that he you know removes this difficulty out of her uh you know body and uh cures her completely if it's good for her and mm -hmm. you know if it's if something else is good for her if it's her time to uh, meet god you know and that's yep. that's what's good for her we will accept that as the ending right and and we we have to believe in our heart that god is the ultimate uh, destination right so mm -hmm. he, will, he will you know uh, end of the day take care of us and you know this this sickness uh, may this sickness be an alleviation for her status with God and uh, God removes all of her sins with this uh, sickness right because mm -hmm. of this sickness. and um, hopefully uh, in the end it's all about uniting with our loved ones, right? So hopefully in the end, one day you are able to unite with her with God, uh, yep. you know, 
once uh, this circus is over. At the end of the day, we are all in this circus called life, and it's temporary. End of the day, for all of us, all of us have to meet death. Uh, diff- each one of us have a different destination as far as how we will die, but we will all die. Right? That's the reality of it. But what counts is that we unite with our loved ones after that death. Right? Our destination is becomes the same with God. So I, I pray for that for you, for you and your most definitely. I appreciate that. And anybody else out there, I, I appreciate I, I and you know appreciate any prayers you can give. I, uh, you know, she's a great woman and she's always been there for my life. In my life, we've had hard times in the beginning. I did not grow up rich. I grew up lower middle class. I like to call it that. Um, you know, okay, just, just so. saying, just part of the social media, like clickbait, say I grew up hillbilly. <laughs> <laughs> I truly did. <laughs> so, you know, but it, it's all right. It's all right, though. Yeah. So, um, you know, it made me the man who I am today. And I can I can never take that back. My, you know, my father, I truly uh, he was going through problems. Um, but, you know, I spent the last years with him and I know that God put him. He I know that God uh postponed him going to him because he knew i was not ready to live without him Mm -hmm. so i i i truly believe that's exactly what he's doing with my mother um you know and not only me but my family members i'm one of four children so i have a youngest i a young younger sister i have an older sister and a younger brother so um you know blessings to all of them and the good thing is is this is bringing all of us you know together so as a family to work together so um but with that being said all right back to the real estate Mm -hmm. let's all do deals together let's let's get this going and let's dominate this damn market all right no matter dominate it crush it every single day every single week set your goals know exactly where you want to get to break it down into actionable steps and take action every single day most definitely all right so with that being said everyone out there um it's come to that that time you have a great day uh if you want to contact me and do deals together my number has been right here this whole time i my my email's been flying down at the bottom here and you know go ahead and contact me i'm happy to work with anybody i'm an open book i really am so um i've contacted so many people has contacted me uh just for advice i give it freely all right um if you want to come on video and 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 we'll record something by all means i'm happy to do that as well so um with that being said have a great day let's all go do deals together and make more business all right Thank you, Randy. There was once a day that I would pray for you. I'd go and misbehave just so you'd notice too. Sneaking looks up and down from across the room.